With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is evaluate the integration of 2x plus 5 into under root of 10 minus 4x minus 3x square dx. So here we have i is equal to the integration of 2x plus 5 into under root of here let me correct it here here we have under root of 10 minus 4x minus 3x square dx now let us write our 2x plus 5 is equal to here a into dy dx of under root of sorry let me correct it here here we have dy dx of into 10 minus 4x minus 3x square plus of b now where a and b are our constants now here after solving it further here we have 2x plus 5 is equal to a into the differential of this value will be minus 4 minus 6x plus b now let's say this is our point number 1 now here here we have 2x plus 5 is equal to here minus of 6ax here plus of b minus 4a now on comparing the coefficients of x and the constant term so here we get minus 6a is equal to 2 and b minus 4a is equal to 5 so here the value of a here is minus 1 by 3 so from here the value now from here the value of b will be minus 4 into minus 1 by 3 and it is equal to 5 so here after solving it further here we have b is equal to b is equal to 11 by 3 now next our 2x plus 5 is equal to a that is minus 1 by 3 into 4 sorry minus 4 minus 6 plus of b that is 11 by 3 from the equation 1 so from the equation 1 now next i is equal to now here we had i is equal to minus 1 by 3 into integration of minus 4 minus 6x into under root of here we have 10 minus 4x minus 3x square dx so from here plus of here we had plus of 11 by 3 i am writing the value here so here we have plus of 11 by 3 into the integration of under root of 10 minus 4 4x minus 3x dx now here let's say that this value this value is our i1 so here we have minus 1 by 3 into i1 now let's say that this value is our i2 so from here we have plus of 11 by 3 into i2 and his value is equal to i let's say that this is our point number 2 this is our point number 2 now consider our i1 so here i1 is integration of minus 4 minus 6x into under root of 10 minus 4x minus 3x square dx now put now here put 10 minus 4x minus x square as equal to t now here let's differentiate both of the sides with respect of x so here we have minus 4 minus 6x dx and it is equal to dt now in this question in our previous step there is a small mistake that is this is minus 4 only now from here we can see that there exists a minus 4 minus 6x into dx already in our question so let's replace this, this with our dt so finally here we have i1 is equal to i1 is equal to the integration of under root here we have t dt now here it is equal to integration of t raised to power 1 by 2 dt and it is equal to t raised to power 1 by 2 divided by t raised to power 1 by 2 plus of 1 divided by 1 by 2 plus of 1 plus c so finally here we have 2 by 3 into t raised to power 3 by 2 plus of c 
now here our i1 i1 is equal to let's put the value of t here so here we have 2 by 3 into t that is t minus sorry 10 minus 4x minus 3x square raised to power 3 by 2 plus of c so let's say that this is our point number third now consider our i2 so here our i2 is the integration of under root of 10 minus 4x minus 3x square dx now here we can write this value as under root of 3 here integration of under root here we have minus of x square plus of 4 by 3 minus 10 by 3 dx now next here after solving it further here we have under root 3 into integration of under root of under root of minus of x square plus here we will multiply and divide with 2 so here we have 2 into 2 by 3 here we can write this 4 as our 2 into 2 3 2 into 2 x here we had x now plus of 2 by 3 whole square minus of 2 by 3 whole square minus 10 by 3 dx so now here we can write this value as after solving it further under root of 3 the integration of under root of here we have under root 34 by 3 whole square minus of x plus 2 by 3 whole square dx now here after solving it further here we have under root of 3 by 2 here into x plus 2 by 3 into under root of under root of under root 34 by 3 whole square minus of x plus 2 by 3 whole square plus of 34 by 9 sine inverse of sine inverse of let me write it correct here this is our sine inverse here x plus 2 by 3 whole divided by under root of 34 by this is our 34 by 3 plus of c so now next here we can write this value as under root of 3 by 2 here into x plus 2 by 3 x plus 2 by 3 into the under root of 34 by 9 minus of x plus 2 by 3 let me correct it here this is our x plus 2 by 3 whole square plus of 34 by 9 sine inverse of 30 sorry 3x plus 2 divided by under root of 34 plus of c now let's say that this is our point number 4 now from using equation number from our equation number second third and four here we get here we get i is equal to minus two by nine into ten minus four x minus three x square raised to power three by two plus of eleven under root three by six by six here into here we have x plus 2 by 3 of under root of here we have 34 by 9 minus of x plus 2 by 3 whole square here we have x plus 2 by 3 whole square plus of plus of I am writing the value here that is 34 by 9 sine inverse of 3x plus 2 divided by under root of 34 plus of c so now from here we can say that that this is our final answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today